hey everyone welcome back to my channel so it's a little moody in here because it is nighttime um and i have several different i'm trying to get the lighting right in my office so we have several different lights some are temporary some are permanent but um today we're really just going to be i'm going to show you guys some updates that i'm doing before i give you all the full tour so my last piece of furniture just arrived so i am super excited to put that together because i think it will complete the space but i do just want to show you all just some things that i got um and then i'm excited to give you all the full tour so let's get into the video so first I want to show you all my curtains. I tried to show it during the daytime, but I feel like because of the lighting, it looks so pretty during the day, um, but you couldn't really see them. So this is the curtains. They're just white. Um, they're a white sheer curtain and then the rod is gold and I love this because the gold accents complement the rest of my office and I love how the white really pops against the wall. Don't mind that picture. We're not done in that area just yet. But also this is my chair. So I love this chair. This is an accent chair. It is velvet. Came from um, Amazon um, and again the gold. Um, legs on the chair i just really like that the gold how i styled my office so far it's not overpowering you know what i mean like it's very i think it's like subtle um the gold touches is not cliche um if you will so but i love the contrast between the color like the cream color of the chair and then against just like the white and then also my walls are almost like a kind of like a off-white cream color so i really like especially during the daytime this wall really pops with the natural sunlight and it just seems like this whole wall is just glowing so um which is why it's very difficult to kind of film looking at this during the day but i really love the chair the chair was super easy to put together it took all like five minutes um and it's so comfortable it's so comfortable it's so plush um and again it is velvet and i'm a sucker for these lines so this is kind of like that moment for the lines um the rug this was something that i actually just got i had it previously in my apartment this was originally in my closet upstairs but i was like hmm this space in the front could use something i have this rug let me see how it works so um i don't want to do too much of the reveal because we're gonna save some stuff for the full tour these are pictures they're gonna go i'm gonna do a slight gallery wall over there but again we'll we'll show that later um and i love how this looks over here so this is like that lantern is like a wicker basket got that from home goods and it's from like the indian brand and this faux pompous grass i already had this this came from my old apartment um and i'm gonna put an inspo of this corner that i'm trying to recreate um and the inspo photo shows actually you know like a base or something sitting on the floor with pompous grass sticking out of it but i was like i have gold so it could be interesting to see how the gold looks again it's not overpowering it matches the legs i just like how it's coming along so far so i'm super excited but anyway we have so this is this wall i'm not going to show you guys the bookshelves or my desk just yet but and i'm not going to show you over here but this is another bookshelf but this wall this is what this area looks like right now so far so i have that's what we're going to do today is just finish up this piece we're gonna do a slight slight very slight gallery wall hang up some pictures over here i do want to mount a tv in the middle i don't have the tv yet um so but what i do have is a circle mirror so i think what i'm gonna do is put the mirror there for the time being and then eventually switch it out once i actually get the tv to put there and then i thought it would be super cute to get um sorry trying to focus to get a 
because I feel like I needed something to go in between the chair and this bookshelf. So at first I was looking at a um, side table, but I couldn't find the right type of aesthetic. So I ended up getting a console table, okay? So that is what I have here. I'm about to bring the box in um, and start to build that, but it's a simple black console table with a glass top. I was really going back and forth to see if I wanted to try to get a console table that was more so this wood color, because I did see like they had some with the top was like a light wood color and the bottom, like the, railing was black but i went with the glass top because i feel like number one if i needed to move it anywhere in my house it can easily um flow without like the color of the wood clashing with something else and two i feel like it will just give the the level of glam that i need so we're gonna see um hopefully it fits in this space uh and then i can sit this beautiful piece on top of that because at first i was going to keep this in here um so i'm wrapping at this point we gonna wrap this up but let's go ahead and build this console table look of the console table I really love the elegance of it it's so simple it's very minimalistic but I think it adds the necessary like the glass just enhances the space and makes it look expensive as opposed to the wood just would have given it the wood top would have given it a different look so I'm loving this corner so far I still need to finish the wall um, so we are about to get that done and then I am going to do the final reveal. I'm so excited y'all. This is looking so good. Oh, one last thing. Um, this is the vase that I mentioned in my, um, Target slash Home Goods. Ross Marshall's haul um, a couple videos back. It finally came in. I really love the way it looks. I don't know if it's going to stay in this position. I just kind of like took a lot of the stuff that was on my desk off because I want my desk to be as clear as possible and I will show that in my next video. But yeah, I'm really loving it. This lamp also is temporary, but I just, I needed more light in here. So I have like three sets of lighting so far. So yeah, so this is what it looks like right now and we are about to add the finishing touches. All right, I can finally kind of give you guys a quick overview of the curtains cause it's not too bright outside. So these are the curtains. I just got some basic sheer ones from Amazon and I love them. They are ceiling to floor. We're they're not all the way on the floor, but it's close enough. <laughs> um, but they just make the room look so pretty. They are pure white and the room is kind of like a, like a off white, almost like a cream color. So I think that the white against the cream, it just looks so pretty. Um, so I am in love. Of course, I got the gold raw to match the gold accents. Um, and it really does cover up the whole, look at this y'all, look at this. This is my view. This is what I've been trying to show you guys. I, I kid you not, I've been trying to film this for the longest to get the right lighting, film it during the right time. It's probably like four o'clock right now, but look at how pretty y'all, look at how pretty this is when you walk in. It's just, ugh, chefs kiss i'm obsessed with my office i'm so obsessed look at this